While Lauren tells Deacon about the story of Sheila and Sugar, Leon continues to tell Sylvia about their love, their great love. <laughs> hey y'all, welcome back to another review with Life with Chester for the Bone and Beautiful April 22nd, 2024. Okay, so we might as well start with Steffi and Leon, then Hope and Finn, and Deacon and Lauren. So Steffi and Leon, so they was talking about what Deacon said, and Leon was saying how, you know, he would feel sorry for him or tell her, you know, it just takes time. But it was Sheila, it was Sheila and all this other stuff. I said, y'all might want to listen to him, y'all might want to listen to him. Spoilers say that Finn listens to Deacon, that him and Deacon go on a mission to find Sheila. I said, do y'all think she locked up? If they got the same face and, you know... Lauren said that Sugar was supposed to be in jail unless they released her, but I doubt they will release her and not tell Lauren them or whatever. So I was like, did she make it seem like she was the one? Is she in jail? I said, that's where they need to look. But yeah, he had asked her uh, Sugar's name, so he's going to look into it. Steffi was telling Leon that Deacon is delusional, and I said, you might want to listen to him, but I feel like a part of her feels like there may be truth to it. There may be truth to it. But even with Lauren, she was like, she hoped that Deacon's wrong. She hoped that Deacon wrong, but a part of her know too. But Stephanie was saying that she basically want to be done with Sheila once and for all. And Leon just kept reminding her that Sheila's dead. She could move on. But she was saying how since Deacon spreading this rumor, spreading these lies, he's so delusional, so crazy. He's an idiot. He's stupid. All these, she keep calling him all these names. And I said, how you going to feel when you find out he's telling the truth? I understand, though. She thinks she finally done with the psychopath, just like Lauren. Lauren said on today's episode, basically, they got a long history list. History list. <laughs> they got a long history in which Sheila and Sugar caused her pain or whatever. But, yeah, Leon was telling her she can relax now that Sheila is gone. And then he started talking about, we was in love. We was so in love. Oh, I said, how? <laughs> you know how Stephanie and them always talking about Brooke and Ridge, destiny and everything. But here they go. They always talk about they was in love and it was so amazing and all this other stuff. And I said, how amazing could it be? When y'all literally, every time they get together, don't they cheat on each other or something? <laughs> one of them cheat and the other one walk away. Then they get back together and the other person cheat. And I say, I feel like you sleeping with his daddy is foul. But then you turn around. Then she sleep with why Wasn't they married or something like that? I said, look, they always sharing. That's why I hope over here in Finn face because they finna get ready to share him next. <laughs> I just got through looking at the spoilers and it just said that Hope and Steffi stand united when it comes to Deacon and Sheila. So I guess this week they're going to be one big happy family. What would they be saying? We one big extended happy family. It's something they always say. We like sisters. I feel like Hope be poking the bear too. She over here asking Finn if a part of him still wishes Sheila was alive. It's uh, Deacon Wright and everything. And I say, you know how this man feel about Sheila. That's why you're here. That's why you struck up this conversation. That's why you keep bringing up the same thing. That's why you told Steffi that she should cut him some slack. <laughs> I said, you know how he feels about Sheila. He knows how he feels about Sheila. Steffi, the only one, I feel like deep down she knows. And Leon keep bringing it up. I said, he always got to sit up and bring. I, that's what I skipped over. Leon brings up Finn. What did he say? Um, he was, When she was talking about Deacon, and he was like, your husband is included. Finn's included or something like that. And she was like, my husband and all this stuff. I said, your husband still care about his mama. And she's still alive. Even if she wasn't, he still care. And then he always over here, he'll be like, he doesn't blame Steffi. Then he'd be like, my birth mother died at the hands of my wife. Or my wife took the knife and stabbed her. <laughs> he just, I mean, that's literally what happened, but still. <laughs> you just know that he feels some type of way still. He just forcing it. Ever since, uh, what's his name? Leon came in that office talking about something. If you don't step up, I will. He been trying to get his act together. But I feel like at the end of the day, it's not going to matter. Because, look, they keep bringing it to the same thing. Liam over here. Look, I forgot that too. Dog, let me see. Liam over here, he keep talking about how he he's so searching and all this other stuff. And then he never fails to mention how he feels about Steffi and all this other stuff. And I said, you ain't doing them a soul searching, sir. Then, like I told y'all last week, I told y'all, anytime somebody decide that they want to change and do better, here comes somebody talking about something. Oh, you're fine just the way you are. No, he ain't. Why would Steffi tell Liam that? I said, well, you know what? I know why she said that because she can't see. She one of those people that feel like a man can do no wrong because she be making excuses for Ridge too. She be talking about Brooke just, she did this and that to my father and all this other stuff. And what did he do? What did he do? And she doing the same thing with Liam. Then Hope over here. Let me see. I already said she asked Finn if a part of him still wishes Sheila was alive. They was over here talking and stuff. I said, why don't, why don't Steffi pop up when they together or, um, Hope, well, Hope and Liam ain't together no more, so why don't Steffi ever pop up when they together talking and stuff? 
And the reason I said it is because Hope I always over here talking about some how do you really feel and all this. And Steffi lucky to have a man like you. She talking about a husband like you and a man like you. Then Finn gonna sit up here and say some uh, what about Liam? <laughs> she said I don't know about the husband part, but uh, father part, yes. <laughs> I said okay. I just realized I didn't write down nothing for Lauren and Deacon. They were just still talking about Sugar and Sheila and her. Hat. They basically identical. They're identical. And um, Sugar wanted Sheila to pay. I said, do y'all think she locked up? Maybe she locked up. Maybe she locked up either way it go. Maybe she's in jail because, again, they both got the same face. Either she locked up for real, for real, or she locked up like she got her locked away somewhere. I said, I don't know where to see, though. But I don't think we're going to see everything to make her. I think they said when Sheila actually makes her return. But that's all that happened on today's episode. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts down below. Stay tuned for the next review. Until next time, deuces. Have a great rest of the day and be safe.